Hello, this is just a short presentation of the VR Vive Interactables uh, series. I just started posting. Uh, so I'm just going to show what you're going to end up with if you follow along with this uh, tutorial series. So let's hit play and have a look. So first of all, you're going to get some buttons. So you're going to get something like this. I'm going to show you how you can do the hand animation. And get something like this. I'm also going to build a rotator, like a handle, a lever or something. We can operate like this, show how we can control different um, limits, like this. And also here's a twister handle where you can like turn a knob or something. And this one is does not have the sound feedback and it doesn't have a limit either. This can be used for doing a screw or something, whatever, and create some interesting stuff that way. And then I'm also going to show you how to build a slider, which is something like this. All of these things here have a snap limit or snapping logic, so you can see you can set them to snap at different points, or you can just turn it completely off like I have with this one, which just rotates freely. Okay, um, I think that was it. Yeah, you can use this to create everything from menu systems to door mechanics, uh, game mechanics where you have to pull a lever to activate something, buttons, um, sliders, handles, you can move anything you basically can come up with using these different um, just three different base objects, really. All of them are physical objects, so there's a bit of consideration with things like um, networking or replication, if you want to do something like that, which I haven't dealt with. So that is something I don't cover in this series here. But apart from that, you should uh, have a pretty good foundation to build all kinds of pretty cool uh, game mechanics in VR. Um, so I hope you will enjoy and thank you for watching. Bye.